God tells you to fish, but we equip you to fish. Years before, on the same beach, when God encouraged me to start a Bible college, I could not deny. University of Jerusalem started with a humble beginning and initial days were tough. Our first office was taken care by just two staffs. Reverend Dr. Albert Jai Singh, the founder of University of Jerusalem contacted me. At first, we discussed in a tea shop, then inside a car. This was the beginning of University of Jerusalem. Now, I am a full-time servant of God, serving the Lord through University of Jerusalem. If it was not God's will, 10 years and 20 convocations would have not been possible. If it was not God's will, it would have not been possible to equip 5,000 plus disciples for His kingdom. If it was not God's will, we would have not reached many countries. Every day is a new motivation for me. Following our eldest path, it gives me a lot of learning. What makes University of Jerusalem so unique? It's not about growing number of students. It's not about spreading across the nations. It's about the students' testimonies, which justifies that God can use anyone. Our first student was about to commit suicide, but now he is serving God. A recent thesis that we have received from a student is surviving on dialysis. His faith made him enrolled in University of Jerusalem. You know what? He wrote a thesis on Father's love. This is divine. This is his calling. I am proud to be a part of it. By the grace of God, we are moving to the new facilities with the state of art classrooms. With fully equipped officers, we want to serve him better. Isaiah 2.3 and Micah 4.2 says, The law shall go out of Zion and the word of the Lord from Jerusalem. By the grace of God, University of Jerusalem has been raising laborers for the end time harvest, equipping the saints for a great revival. I really want to congratulate our dear Reverend Dr. Albert J. Singh for a wonderful work that he is doing in raising warriors for Christ. The future plans of this ministry is so powerful. I believe with all my heart, it's going to make a remarkable history in the days to come. God bless you, University of Jerusalem. It's a great joy for me to congratulate my bishop, leader, a great man of God, whom I love, Albert J. Singh, the man who has founded the Uni University of Jerusalem. And I, I had a privilege to travel with him, receive the vision, what he has in his heart. And from that moment, I started to pray. And today, they are crossing a milestone of a decade of a great ministry, graduating more than 5,000 young people, older ones, leaders and pastors, scattered all over the world, spreading the gospel, building the kingdom of God. What a great work and what a great ministry which God has entrusted in the hand of my brother, Albert J.C. and his son, Abby. I love them and I pray for them that years to come, God will enlarge their boundaries and God will give them more vision and mission in their hand. And I believe they are going to raise many, many more leaders in this land. May the Lord bless the University of Jerusalem எனக்கு மிகவும் அன்பானவர்களே உங்கள் ஒவ்வொருவரையும் கர்த்தர் இயேசுவின் மதுர நாமத்தினால் நான் ஆசீர்வதிக்கின்றேன் யூனிவர்சிட்டி ஆஃப் ஜெருசலேம் தன்னுடைய பத்தாவது ஆண்டு விழாவை கொண்டாடுவது எவ்வளவு மகிழ்ச்சியாக இருக்கின்றது இந்த நேரத்திலும் என்னுடைய நெஞ்சார்ந்த வாழ்த்துக்களை இந்த யூனிவர்சிட்டி ஆஃப் ஜெருசலேம் இந்த ஸ்தாபனத்திற்கு நான் தெரிவித்துக் கொள்கின்றேன் இது நடத்தி வரக்கூடிய அருமையான சவரர் ரெவரண்ட் டாக்டர் ஆல்ஃப்ரட் ஜெய்சிங் என்னுடைய நல்ல நண்பர் அவர் மாத்திரமல்ல அவருடைய அருமையான அருமந்த புதல்வன் எபினேசர் என்னை மிக அதிகமாக நேசிக்கக்கூடிய 
ஒரு தங்க மகன் வேதத்திலே ரெண்டு சாமுவேல் புத்தகத்திலே ஐந்தாம் அதிகாரம் அதில் பத்தாவது வசனத்திலே தாவிது நாளுக்கு நாள் விருத்தி அடைந்தான் என்று இந்த வசனம் காணப்படுகின்றது அதே போல இந்த யூனிவர்சிட்டி நாளுக்கு நாள் விருத்தி அடைந்து கொண்டே போக நான் கர்த்தரை நோக்கி பார்த்து ஜெபிக்கின்றேன் I would like to express my felicitations for the 20th International Convocation of the University of Jerusalem which is taking place in our church. I praise God for your institution which has recognized thousands of pastors and lay preachers with the highly respected degrees and have motivated them to do God's ministry more enthusiastically all over the world. May God bless you and your institution abundantly. God bless you all. Praise God. Greetings to all in the name of our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ. It's a privilege to speak a few words about the Jerusalem University. It's already they are teaching and sending people past 10 years. Now I pray that God bless the convocation and the new students. the days to come the bible says people are perishing because of the lack of knowledge so i pray in the last days this university will teach you to rightly divide the word of god and prepare the army of people for his glory amen hi it's such a joy to even to speak few words uh, about the 20th international convocation that's about to happen for our all our friends who have enrolled in this uh, university of jerusalem and uh, i'm really very uh, proud for what they've been doing for the past more than 10 years uh, over 5000 students have been uh, graduated and uh, i just want to wish all the best and uh, god's choicest blessing and may god expand and enlarge your boundaries that you will have a tremendous impact in uplifting so many people god bless you Uh, praise God and uh, it's such a joy and a privilege and honor to wish and congratulate University of Jerusalem uh, for a decade of ministry and for a decade of serving God. It's such a joy to know that 5,000 plus students have graduated through University of Jerusalem and there had been 20 uh, convocations in this last decade. I just wish them and bless the University of Jerusalem for many more years of serving God as the scripture says. the the harvest is plentiful and the laborers are few uh, i just want to wish and encourage and congratulate university of jerusalem as they bring out the laborers for god's kingdom many more years of fruitful ministry and it's a joy uh, to be uh, uh, having association and relationship uh, relationship with robert albert and uh, uh, with ebenezer albert too and it's i would like to take this uh, privilege to tell that for the last 7 years they've been a part of the church very committed i'm always uh, very blessed by the humility of reverend albert and even ebenezer who is very committed in the church and i really wish them and we st- we, we will stand along in prayers and in every other way in order for university of jerusalem to move ahead for the glory of god congratulations once again God bless you. பிரியமானவர்களே ஆண்டவராகிய இயேசு கிறிஸ்துவின் நாமத்தில் என் அன்பின் வாழ்த்துக்கள் யூனிவர்சிட்டி ஆஃப் ஜெருசலேம் தன்னுடைய இருபதாவது பட்டமளிப்பு விழாவை காண்கிறது என்பதில் நான் பெரும் மகிழ்ச்சி அடைகிறேன் சுமார் பத்து ஆண்டுகளுக்கு மேலாக இவ்வூழியத்தை கர்த்தர் பலமாய் ஆசீர்வைத்து வருகிறார் சுமார் ஐயாயிரத்துக்கு மேற்பட்ட மாணவர்கள் இந்தியாவிலும் பிற அயல் நாடுகளிலும் இந்த ஆசீர்வாதமான யூனிவர்சிட்டியில் பயின்று பட்டம் பெற்று வல்லமையுள்ள ஊழியக்காரர்களாய் திகழ்கிறார்கள் நிச்சயமாகவே வருகிற நாட்களில் இந்த ஊழியத்தின் மூலமாய் கர்த்தர் மாபெரும் அறுவடையையும் ஆசீர்வாதத்தையும் கொடுத்து இவர்களை சந்தோஷப்படுத்துவார் என்பதில் ஒரு சந்தேகம் இல்லை காட் பிளஸ் யூ ஆல் கிரீங்ஸ் டு யூ இன் நேம் ஆஃப் த லார்ட் அண்ட் சேவி ஜீசஸ் கிரைஸ்ட் இட்ஸ் அ கிரேட் ஜாய் அண்ட் பிரிவிலேஜ் டு ஷேர் ஆன் தார்ட் வீடியோ the small little greetings for the university of jerusalem that god has enabled them to function for this past 10 years god has been faithfully leading this university 
and Dr. Albert in putting together a wonderful curriculum that would be such a blessing to everyone who really needs to know and wants to grow in the knowledge of Christ. This university uh, is a correspondence university and it really makes uh, sure that people do not leave uh, their homes or do not leave their churches or their ministry context to come over into a seminary uh, campus to study so that they are removed from their uh, places of work or places of ministry but to be in the ministry on the job and yet have the knowledge of Jesus Christ increase in their life so that they can be effective in the ministry context. And therefore, I just want to congratulate every effort that has been put together. I want to congratulate all the efforts put together by the faculty and the curriculum team. And I pray that God would help you improve and may you be a quality kind of an education so that this entire, entire world will know that there is one true living God who is Christ Jesus in and through your university too. May this ministry be blessed. May everything that they do prosper. May God bless you. May God be with you. Amen. I am glad that people are joining every day. I am glad that God is using us. I am glad that Almighty God using University of Jerusalem for His Kingdom. He is strengthening us every day. What we have done is merely a beginning. His vision is big and we are sold out for it. Thank you for standing with us. May peace be upon Jerusalem.